Welcome back, traders. So we are approaching midnight, and that is going to be our breakthrough. And I'm going to show you something. So I have all my rewards ready to go. I completed these um, all earlier today. So we're going to see if I'm able to go ahead and claim the breakthrough box just by claiming these here in two minutes. So pretty exciting. Um, if you don't know what it is, I'll wait. Um, if you don't know by now, it's all over the internet. So let's go ahead. <laughs> I want to look at the Pokemon that is going to be and see what we have. But for the people who don't know, I don't want to spoil it yet. So we have two minutes. So I want, I'm going to wait actually one minute past midnight just to make sure. Uh, otherwise, it's going <laughs> to... I don't want to go out and do the whole thing again and get the stops and then uh, complete the challenges. So... Uh, on the other hand, let's go ahead and take a look at this really quick. Um, Shadow Claw, Dragon Claw, Mew. Now, it took me quite a few TMs. We'll take a look at that after this. Uh, or maybe in the next video or something on how many it actually took to get that. Um, it wasn't as much as you think. So, But I'm happy with this. Tested it out. Works fantastic. Uh, very fun. So, yep, there you go. Shadow Claw, Dragon Claw, Mew. All right, so we have one minute to go. <laughs> this is going to be good. Well, technically two because I'm going to wait one minute. But I feel like I'm just going to do it right at midnight. Um, yeah, so it is going to be one of the legendary birds. So we'll see which one it is. Um, I already know what the 100 is. I'm looking for a 93. I want 15 attack, 10 defense. And 15 stamina so um, I, I forgot what number that was gonna be but uh, nonetheless we'll see here so it is midnight I can go ahead and do the breakthrough um, we'll go ahead and wait till that says 1201 then we'll go ahead and get this underway folks because I'm very anxious but at the same time like I said I don't want to ruin this we'll just wait and make sure uh, it is secure here and that's a good trick, so if you want to just uh, have them all ready for the next day, make sure you just complete your tasks, and then just tap on it uh, on the day of. But we're going to see right now if this is going to work. So come on, clock. Let's go. Let's see that one. 1201. Come on. And people are suggesting that I change my time uh, to another time zone. But now nah, I'll just wait until... Um, my time comes all right so here we go uh let's see if this works bingo bingo all right all right so keep up the great work now let's see what you've discovered all right i'm going to claim these really quick oh i need to claim the big box first breakthrough all right so i got the ultra balls and i'm gonna put out a sheet after this as to what you could have gotten inside that because there's more options other than the ultra balls so let's go ahead and see what this is it is a moltres in snow look at that <laughs> wow that is a uh the low one isn't it so i'm going to go ahead and uh pineapple this so i'm actually in the garage in <laughs> in my house this is really weird catching a legendary like this um all right so pineapple it's been a while <laughs> since i've thrown one of these I'll try to catch one of these mulches, so I'm going to wait for it to drop down a little bit further. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and just toss it. Great throw. And what is the catch rate? Just one ball and done? All right, so pineapple it, okay, guys? All right, pineapple. Four-day streak mulches. Look at that. All right, should have turned on a star piece. Oh, well. So there we have it. <laughs> Moltres. Uh, bingo, bingo. I had plenty of them. So now let's go ahead and take a look at what I've got here. Uh, let's just go ahead and go to the legendary birds. And see. Oh, right down here. Alright, so Phoenix is my uh, almost maxed out one. I have 70 candies. So that was nice. That little boost there. I could max that out. Works perfect just like this. Uh, and then we have 95 from before. This was, yep, last uh, summer. And then, yeah, they, they get, you know, 
they go down in percentages. So uh, there we have it. It is a Moltres. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at everything that you can get inside these boxes, shall we? Okay, so for this week's breakthrough box, we have 2,000 Sardas, 2,000 XP, and a level 15 Moltres. We don't know if it's going to stay the same uh, legendary or switch up for the next breakthrough box. We'll just have to wait and see. Now, uh, for one of these prizes, you can only get one of these. You saw I got the Ultra Balls. Uh, you can get also three rare candies, 20 Pokeballs. I would have preferred that, or five pineapple berries. Okay, so uh, there you have it. That was um, it was pretty good. I mean, what do you, <laughs> you know? It's something. It's more content to the game. I enjoyed it. Um, it was, you know, I can't wait to see different legendaries implemented, or maybe even shinies at some point in time through these breakthrough boxes. Would that be something? And I'm also excited to see what the next mythical uh, quest is going to be uh, as far as what Pokemon are we going to see. Jirachi, Celebi, uh, I, I even think Dioxys is counted as a mythical Pokemon, uh, but uh, we'll have to wait and see what uh, the future brings. So let's go ahead and check out how many times it, it took me to get Dragon Claw on my Mew. Okay, so here we go. I was just basically looking for anything that was super effective towards those raid bosses uh so it's on blizzard right now and this is going to be one so gyro ball that's one and uh energy ball that's two i was thinking to myself nah i can't do that we have to keep on going so back to gyro ball are you kidding me that's crazy right there that's three <laughs> out of all the moves back to gyro ball all right so three so far Rock side, that's four. All right, let's keep it going. Committed now. Five. And what are we going to get? Six. It only took six to get there. Not bad. Okay, trainers, now I have a challenge for you. So we have the new Sneasel raids, right? It is dark and ice type, two times weak against fighting types. So what I want you to do or try to do is use a Machamp. Now the Sneasel doesn't matter what move it has for this challenge. It, it can be whatever, okay? Um, you're probably probably going to need cloudy weather, more than likely. And what it is, is you go in with a Machamp, you don't dodge one time, and you see if you can take that Sneasel out with just your Machamp. No dodging whatsoever. So you're going to need cloudy weather and probably counter dynamic punch moveset on your Machamp. I'm using my maxed out 100, so I was barely there, and <laughs> but I did it nonetheless. So... Uh, yeah, let's see if you guys can do that. This, it was pretty fun. It took me one try. Uh, like with the cloudy weather, Machamp is just a crazy strong Pokemon. You can you can go up into a, a gym and just run through everything, even Dragonites. I mean, flying types, it doesn't matter what it is. In cloudy weather, Machamp rules all. So we're going to take a look at this. Um, so level 2 Sneasel. Uh, like I said, it doesn't have to be any move specific type. It could be anything so just have a ball with that. And with that said, let's go ahead and check this out and good luck. Take care trainers.